Hi everybody and welcome to the Thursday afternoon tune-up. I am Diane Spadolo and this is episode number 20 and this video series is brought to you by Accelerate Your Success, the business booster program for entertainers. After this is over you should jump on over to Facebook and join my free Facebook group by the same name Accelerate Your Success. Think of this video as your information and inspirational pit stop before the race, which is your weekend. So, as a small business owner, what do you do when the social media world comes to a screeching halt? Well, yesterday we got a little sample of what would happen as a global glitch affected both Instagram and Facebook, making liking, posting, and commenting difficult if not impossible. I use both of these media sites to support my face painting business as I'm sure you do and I add Twitter and LinkedIn to support my coaching business for creative professionals. Accelerate your success. But social media is not the most important thing in my marketing arsenal, not by a long shot. Can you guess why? Is it because I was born in the age of dinosaurs and educated without the help of the internet? No. Is it because as a mom, I hated social media when my kids were young? So many perverts to worry about, not to mention the cyberbullying. No. Is it because it often becomes a distraction from what we really need to do to grow our business? Like reach out to our ideal clients and show them what we can do to help them solve their problems? Eh, perhaps. But the real reason is because of what happened yesterday. Control. Some would say, I'm a control freak. Yesterday, I had no control. There are lots of things that we can control in our jobs and our lives, and we can even control our reactions when life gives us lemons or lemonade. But you can't control the weather, another important thing in our business, and you can't control social media. So use it as a supplement. Post today where you're going to be this weekend if you're painting in the public. Ask your clients to rate and recommend you. That's called social proof of your worth. Post photos of your practice, your finished designs, your menu boards if you use them to help educate people about your business. But when it is time to really connect, to speak directly with your customers, your prospects, or your artists, please, for the love of Mike, do it over email, person to person, where no one else can interfere in the communication. Yesterday, Messenger wasn't working. If that's how you rely on getting gigs, it's a problem. Are you collecting emails from everyone who contacts you through any avenue? Whether you book the gig or not, you should be, and you should be keeping them in a safe electronic database. I use Manage Yourself for that purpose, but if you have any questions, get in touch with me. Then you can control the conversation, not somebody in Silicon Valley who apparently fell asleep at the monitor yesterday. Have a great weekend. The weather's supposed to be fantastic in lots of the country. And I'll talk to you next week.